What is up everyone, my name is Mike from Mad Gaming, and welcome back to the Ludum Dare 34 Game Jam coverage. And this game is called A Shot in the Dark. Now, I've downloaded this one. It looked quite interesting. It looked like a kind of isometric kind of game where you're having to navigate your character through kind of dark areas. So, apart from that, I have no idea what I'm going to talk about at this point, so let's just crack on. Oh, yes, okay. Wow, okay, yes. So, as I said, this is kind of an isometric style game, and it's... It's kind of pseudo three-dimensional. But it's not three-dimensional. I think the character model is three-dimensional. You have to navigate your way through a series of dark corridors. And I have a crossbow. Okay, right click to aim. And apparently it's also in first-person mode as well. So I can kind of see where I'm going. Ah. Ah. Now these actually act as lights. Which will be very handy for the few... Show oh, bollocks. <laughs> fell down. Right, so what I need to do is I do actually need to get that crossbow. And I need to fire off a couple of shots. This is only the first level. Um, right click to aim. And I need to get to there. So if I fire one towards the end. Okay, that happened. One there. One there. That should get me there. Right, yes. Now, I just have to follow the path by clicking on the arrows. This is really clever. It's a cool concept. Oh crap, I've lost... There we go, there we go. Run to the run to the light, run to the light. Ah, oh, level complete. Awesome. Right, so yeah, so this is a pretty damn cool concept. Right, now where do I have to go? I've got two ammo to do this. Oh man, this is... Right, I'm just going to test this. Can I actually light these torches by shooting at them? Yes, I can! Right, so that actually makes a lot of sense. Cool, okay. That one was quite easy compared to the last one. So what I need to do is I actually need to shoot the torches to light my way across. This is a really cool concept. I'm actually quite impressed with this concept. Right, that, that's it. Right, okay, so what I need to do, I think... Is try and shoot my way. Right, so that's not a path. Right, so let's illuminate where I'm standing. Anywhere. Right, okay, so this is where I'm standing. Okay, so I actually have to go this way by the looks of things. No. I have to go around that way. Right, so this is about as far as I got. I have to keep going. This is, the, the, I, oh man, this is quite cool. Okay, so that looks like the end of the walkway. Yes, it is the end of the walkway. Right, okay. Can I now get onto here? No! Shit! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was a bit shit. Right, okay, so I'll do what I did last time. I'm going to light this up here. I know, I know I'm wasting a lot of ammunition here, but this seems to be by far the best way of actually seeing where the hell I'm supposed to go. Right, let's do that. Just take it nice and slow, because there's no timer, there's no rush. I don't have to rush. I was right, I was right, I was right. I was right to come here, but maybe I'd cut the corner too quickly. Okay. Now where? Because the, the finish is there. S ah, okay. Right, so there's a path going down this way. Ah, I see you. Now... Ah, ha. I think I may be okay. Just a couple of shots left on here. This is such a cool little concept. I, I really like this concept. I really, really like it. So then you a little bit further. And up here. This is a yeah, as I said, this is a really, really awesome idea for a puzzle game. Alright, okay. I can imagine these levels are gonna get Stupid 
Wow, actually, am I slightly higher up? Alright, let's work my way along, because I can see the path from here. I wonder if I can actually reach it. Oh, okay, this is the path I... This is yeah. As I said, this is a really cool idea. I can I can I can I can get around with this idea. I'm wasting my ammo, but ah, there's actually a torch over there. Let's light that one up. There we go. Is that ah? So I can actually fall onto this bit. Right, okay. Right, I understand. That's cool. Ah, there we go. That one wasn't too bad. Okay, it wasn't too bad, that one. Wow. Okay, this one... Wow, okay. That's a lift, isn't it? Oh, man. I'm going to have to time how I jump onto that lift. Right. Shit. <laughs> okay, so the lift actually comes down at that point. That's cool. So now I can jump on the lift. No, not jump off the lift. Jump on the lift. You idiot. Up we go. And this takes me up to this bit. There we go. Which I can actually see. And then there should be one more lift there. We stand on that. Okay, this is not too bad. I'm understanding this now. I was a bit confused at first. I was thinking, how the hell am I supposed to get on the top? Uh, now I can run. Run, 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 run. Don't fall. Don't fall. Oh, I thought she was going to fall down. Well, how many levels are in this? I like the concept of this game. I really do. I like the idea of having to be very selective with the way you light up the area. So, light all the torches first. They didn't really do much for me, did they? They were really crap. Okay, so I can actually go along this path here, to here, somehow. I like as well that once you've started to shoot the light around, you kind of, it does spread. So if you look here, can you see that this bit here is very slightly lit up now? So you get to start to get a bit of an idea of the way the map works. So I, I, I can't, ah, there's a lift here. Right, that makes sense. Yeah, they wouldn't introduce the lift mechanic if there was a reason for it, would they? Now, which way do I go to get on the lift? Which way does it turn? Come down here? Yes, okay. I think I'm on. I'm on. Yes, I'm on. Okay. Awesome. Cool. And off here? Yes. Next level. Okay, so there's still more levels to go. Right, there's a lift there. Whoa, okay. This is different. I can actually see a branching path. This is almost like, yeah, you're having to feel your way around in the dark because you can't see... You cannot see what's right in front of your face. You have to literally... There we go, look. And you can see this is actually... If I would have gone straight ahead there, I would have fallen down into the pit. This is such a cool concept. So then that should now come down, and then I can just run straight onto that. There we go. Is it there, yes, there we go. All you have to do is just take it nice and easy. Take it slow. Just be very careful about where you put your footsteps. Just to there, to there, and then I'm just going to double check, make sure. I know I'm probably just being a giant wimp about it, but yeah, I was pretty sure this was the exit. There we go. Nice. Oh, oh look, a big red button. Shoot the big red button. Boing! Okay. With the... Right, so maybe if I stand on the lift, and then I have to shoot the button. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that worked. That worked. There's some pretty neat little concepts in here. I, I, I love these type of kind of experimental games where it's not necessarily something I've seen before. 
I mean, obviously you've seen lots of different, you know, puzzle platforms, but this is just something completely different. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Ba ding ba ding a ding. Oh, one ammo. Right. So what do I do with my one ammo? Fire in the middle one. I'm guessing. Run. Pretty fast. Can I do that? It looks like I could do that. Yay! That was very easy. Oh, look, I think that's all of them for now. Okay, cool. That game was really interesting. The way you had to just kind of pick your way around the level. It was like almost as if you were completely blind, apart from having to feel your way around the level. The crossbow was quite cool, maybe slightly clunky, but it gave you a way of kind of picking your way through. So once I started to slow down a little bit, once I started to kind of just very gently creep my way through the levels, things got a lot easier. I'd like to see this idea built upon. It's quite a cool concept. I don't think I've actually any seen anything like this at all. But anyway, the link to this game is in the description below. Also feel free to check out the other Little Dare games that are out. There's a link to those in the description as well. Thank you everyone so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to drop a like. Also subscribe to my channel for new videos on Monday and Friday. See you again soon. Oh, I'm nearly there. Oh, I'm nearly there. Oh, the hype is real. Holy crap, the hype is real. Okay. And up on here. And then one more.